For 25 years, Oddworld has been bringing a unique universe to life. It's a universe with instantly recognisable characters, bizarre creatures, beautifully dangerous environments, and a whole host of hazardous situations. Oddworld's games are fun, story-driven adventures with underlying philosophical dilemmas that are relevant to our complicated world and societal views. It was an innovative idea in 1994, and just as important now. The goal was to tell stories through the medium of video games about ironies that exist in our world. Biker's Fine Foods Division is honoured to offer the final can of greedy caviar to the highest bidder. Hula! We rounded them up, ignored their cries. All right, we got them and maybe get the thing off early. We cut them all up for paramite pies. The heroes of Oddworld speak to issues that transcend politics and address the greater challenges facing their species as well as the human condition and its dilemmas. From the dark and oppressive world of Abe, where labour controls and systematic suppression are the norm, through to the water-starved dust bowls of Strangers' Wrath, where the indigenous people face displacement, there are many themes playing out within Oddworld. Both Abe and Munch are heroes who sit at the very bottom of the food chain, and while Stranger may be better placed in that chain, he still has plenty of obstacles to overcome. The creation of Abe was partly inspired by indigenous people and people of colour who have suffered at the hands of intolerant corporate profiteers. He is the remnant of an indigenous culture that is connected to the landscape and who had the type of power we still associate Native Americans and Shaolin monks with today. Munch is the very last of his kind. Imagine how desperate your plight would be if the existence of an entire species was counting on you. But nobody seems bad. And Stranger must deal with prejudice, an unfair society and cultural mindsets that mirror our own world with an absurd familiarity. The industrialization and commercialization of a once thriving ecosystem is a common backdrop, but alongside this, Oddworld also touches on overhunting and cruel animal testing from Big Pharma. Look, you and I spend what, 20 hours each week catching critters? That's 20 hours a week we could be researching more addictive nicotines, sweeteners, baby food additives, sedatives, laxatives. And then there's privatization of natural resources and the rising cost of healthcare. Due to the unique nature of this case, the operation is shaping up to be rather... complicated. <laughs> well... Give or take a few grand. What? All of these themes, these philosophical dilemmas, are played out front and centre, but they're wrapped up in a gaming experience which doesn't sacrifice fun or enjoyment. They are experiences that have inspired fans from all over the world with their deeper, more meaningful messages. 25 years later, and Soulstorm will be no different. <laughs> No,